In this video I'm going to be showing you a little bit of a small software project I've been working on during the weekend. This piece of software I call the Stratagem Launcher and is to be used in the Hell Divers uh, video game. So mostly this video will be understood by players of Hell Divers. In the GitHub page there's a description of what it does and how it works. But I'm going to do a demonstration now. First uh, I'll be downloading the release and the executable which is this jar file over here. It does require for the PC to have Java installed but this, these days all PCs have it so it's an executable so just double clicking on it it will launch and you will see this small window opening up here and it shows what it's the seems to be a numpad this is because this is going to be mapping the stratagem codes of the game to the numpad of the keyboard so for example if I want to be using this stratagem over here I can click I'll say okay I'm going to be using 7, 8 and 9 for these blue stratagems and then I'm going to be using 6 for the fire and 5 for uh, the nuke so 7 when I, I click on that on 7 I have a list of stratagems to choose so I'm going to be choosing the that one then let's say 8 is going to be the machine gun 9 is going to be the shield and then 5 I'm going to use the nuke and 6 the fire right so I have different buttons for different strategies. By the way, when I did this selection, uh, any file showed up in the folder next to the where the executable was. That's to save the configuration. So if I close this, next time I open it, instead of being blank, it's going to show the same configuration that I had before. So what this is doing is this is listening to whenever I press a button in the keyboard. These uh, are the numpad again. So whenever I press 7 in my numpad keyboard, uh, this stratagem code will be uh, triggered. Let's see an example. Now I'm showing the game in uh, windowed mode, just for the demonstration purposes, but the, the game could be full screen and have the stratagem launcher uh, in the background, and it will still work, no problem. So here we see that if I had to manually trigger, let's say, the shield, I will have to press control key and then down, up, left, right, right, and so forth and so on. But here, if I just press the 9 in my numpad, it automatically uh, pressed control and the sequence, and now I have it ready to be launched. And then I can launch that there. Supplies incoming. Press 5, it's gonna have the nuke. If I press 8, stand by. Gonna... Equipment on its way. Dropping uh, equipment. Repeat. Run. Here's an angle where you see that, like for example, if you press the 5 numpad, you see how I got the, the bomb right there. I press 7 and I get the exosuit. Basically that's how it works. And uh, at any time, if, it, if this was full screen, then I could alt-tab and then go to the stratagem launcher right? and change whatever real time. Technically this could be considered cheating, but because the game is co-op and you're not taking advantage of everyone by doing this, then if anything you're just robbing yourself from the complexity of the game, the challenge of the game. But as you can see in the description of my GitHub page, the only reason why I did is to prove a point. That anything that uh, is a repetitive task, like for example calling stratagems, then it can be automated. Just proving a point. I had a lot of fun doing this uh, small piece of software and I had a lot of fun playing the game. Links are in the description. I hope you like this video. I'm Nero Guru. Have a nice day.